Welcome to Snapdeal. In this video we will learn how you can do bulk listing. To do bulk listing, first of all search seller.snapdeal.com. Now log in with your registered email and password. After logging in, your seller dashboard will open. On the left side of dashboard, select catalog option for listing. After that click on add product in the option given above. From here you can choose whether you want to do single or bulk listing. In this video we will tell you how to do bulk listing. To do bulk listing, first click on the download light sheet. First of all, you will search the category of your product from the search bar given above and the product will appear in the drop down below, select it directly. Also you can directly select from the super categories given below. Then select your product category, subcategory and product type. Now you have to enter the name of your brand. If your brand name is existing then it will appear in the drop down and you can select directly from there. Or you can also create a new name. After filling all the details, click on download. Now you have to create a size chart in which first of all select the fit type of your product from drop down. After that select the size. Snapdeal gives you all the sizes option in drop down, you just have to select the size according to your product. Now you have to fill the remaining details according to your product like brand size, waist size, product length and inseam. If you start filling the size numbers incorrectly, click the reset button to fill the sheet again. Remember that once you save the details you cannot make changes. To make changes, raise a query from the seller panel. Now click on the download button to download the sheet and open it. After opening the sheet, you will get to options. To fill the sheet click on Disable Macron. After opening Excel you will have two sheets. First sheet, data definitions which provides you a detailed overview of what you have to fill in the sheet. From this sheet, you can know through examples that what you have to fill in which column and in what manner. Now click on the second sheet that is template in which you will fill the information related to your product. As you can see here you will get to color columns red and blue. It is mandatory to fill the red column and you can fill additional information in blue column to increase the visibility of your product. And on the top of the sheet you will get the option of your category, subcategory, guidelines and export sheet. First of all you have to fill the SKU stock keeping unit code. Remember this code will be different for all products. Then brand name and product name was auto filled in the sheet. After that you will add the MRP and selling price of your product. Remember the selling price should not be more than MRP. After that you can select the fit type of your product. Size chart. Color. Fabric. Style. Waist rise. Size. Select all information from drop down. You will not find stretchability option in every category. This option is available only in limited categories like jeans category. Fill manufacturer name and address. After that select the country of origin of your product. This field will automatically show India or if you want to change then change it from drop down. Or if you are importing the product then fill the field otherwise fill not applicable. After that fill how many items are there in your pack and fill in the name and address of the packers. Net content. How much pack are you providing and then fill the style code and name.
If you want to increase the visibility of your product, you can fill the blue column. For example, you can fill generic keywords in which you can describe the qualities of your product. In inventory, you have to fill that how much stock of your product is available, in how many days you can ship the order during shipping time and in height, width, length and weight you have to fill details of packed product. In the images, you have to add the link of minimum one image of your product. Otherwise, if you want to add more images, then add them in the blue columns. In the offer group name, if your products are same and have different size and color, then they lie in same group. And if your product are different, then they lie in different group. After filling all the details, click on export sheet. If any field in your sheet is filled incorrectly or empty, an error will be shown and that field will be shown in red mark. Fill a red mark field and export the sheet back. After the sheet is exported, it will be saved on your system. Click on catalog option on seller panel then on add product. To upload a sheet, click on upload content sheet, select your file and click on open. Complete the bulk listing by clicking on the submit button. To track your listings, select the catalog option in the left menu of the dashboard. Now click on track listing. As you can see from here, you can access the draft listing. Under review listing, approved listing, and you can see the status of rejected listing. For more information, raise a query from the seller panel and our team will contact you within 2-4 to 48 hours.